Skiing off piste on Sunday morning, Formula One legend Michael Schumacher fell and hit his head at this resort in the French Alps. The 44-year-old German was airlifted to a local hospital before being transferred to another facility for further examination. Mr. Schumacher was admitted to the Grenoble University Hospital Centre at 12.40 p.m. He suffered from severe cranial trauma and was in a coma when he arrived, which required neurosurgical intervention. He remains in a critical condition. The former motor racing world champion was with his teenaged son at the time of the accident. Specialist neurosurgeon Professor Gérard Saillon was flown in from Paris to oversee treatment. He previously operated on Schumacher following a serious accident at the British Grand Prix in 1999. At the go-kart centre in his hometown, where Schumacher first developed a passion for racing, locals were swift to react to the news. He drove throughout his whole career, which was high risk and everything went well, but now he's had a skiing accident. Bad luck, unfortunately. Widely regarded as one of the greatest Formula One drivers of all time, Schumacher won a record 91 victories before retiring from the sport in 2012.